When you came here for your interview, it was your first job interview as an openly gay man. What were you expecting? For the first time in my life, when I was walking in, I knew that the people that were interviewing me knew my whole story. Instead of worrying about whether or not that would come up or whether or not I would have to uh, be in an uncomfortable situation with when a question was asked about, I don't know, my wife or my family or something like that. Uh, and I think the, the, uh, the two guys that I was interviewing with, Peter Guber and Joe Leica, we were probably two or three hours into our conversation before one of them said, hey, you know that story that came out a few months ago, how did that work out for you? And then we were on to talking about how we we're going to build the Warriors into a great franchise. So that was pretty much the, the sum conversation on the subject, which, you know, in retrospect, after that interview was like, wow, that, that's kind of amazing. The Warriors didn't care that you were gay? <laughs> uh, no. They cared about trying to build a great franchise and were trying to bring whatever talent they could to accomplish that. Were you surprised that they didn't care? That it uh, got buried, it was a throwaway in your interview? Uh, I guess I was hoping for that, but I didn't really know what to expect. So if it was a surprise, it was a pleasant surprise. And uh, it pretty much, you know, the issue was off the table before we even got started.